Hey guys, I'm going to do a quick screencast on how to speed up your video or slow it down. So how to speed up or slow down your video online using a free tool, a free website called Kapwing. So the first step is just to come to this website, which is spelled K-A-P-W-I-N-G, Kapwing. You can Google it or you can just type it right into your um, browser bar, kapwing.com. Then you'll see once you would land on this page, you can just directly upload your video. If you have the file on your computer, then you can upload it. Um, or if you're trying to speed up a YouTube video, you can paste the URL to that video. Um, I'm going to go ahead and drag and drop the video from my computer onto this button. And then it should start uploading. Depending on the size of your video, it should take just several seconds basically for it to upload. If it's a really small video, it should almost upload instantaneously. Now my video has loaded, it's at 100%. Here's the video, it doesn't really have sound or like you probably can't hear it, but this video speed changer does work with sound um, if there is sound associated with your video. Um, so then yeah, you can see here, you can either um, slow down your video by um, decreasing the speed to like 25% of what it once was. Um, half speed, so this is just like half a slow, here's 75%. Um, and you can also speed up your video. So here's 1.5 speed, double speed, and 4x speed. So um, for this video, I wanted to speed it up. One other feature, or a couple other features I wanted to point out, you can trim your video in Kipwings. So like let's say as soon as it loads, you can just trim that video down to the section you want. So let's say I only wanted this small section of like, you know, the apple being added, I can just uh, reduce it to that section. There I go. Now I just click done trimming. And now you can see like just that apple is like four speed here. Um, you'll also see how long your video is. Uh, it was eight seconds. Now, uh, since I 4x speed, it'll only be two seconds long. The output will be. Then once your video looks good, um, I'm going to undo this trim because I want it to be more of the video. I want it to be the whole thing, actually. Um, now that I've undone that trim, I can just go ahead and click create. And now my video will be processed with 4x speed. Um, oops, so you can see here that... Um, uh, this is all processed on a remote machine, so it's all like um, happening in the cloud. It's not like heating up your computer or taking up your CPU. Um, it should take probably like a minute or so, depending on the size of the video that you uploaded. Um, so yeah, you can see that that just for this long of a video, which is a minute, uh, one minute and 37 seconds long, it took what, like maybe 10 seconds or I don't know, something like that. Okay, so now my video is done. I can go back and edit if I want to change the speed settings. You can see it's it's like been created into like a 4x speed here. See how it's much faster. Um, I can download that directly um, to publish on social media or to or I can share this URL. If, so yeah, that's how you speed up or slow down a video um, using a free online tool called Kapwing. Um, thanks for watching. And if you want more video tips, just subscribe in this channel. I'm Julia, one of the creators of Kapwing. I love like talking to people, talking to uh, people that use the product. So please feel free to leave comments or reach out to me over email or Twitter or anything else. Um, thanks a lot. And that's how you speed up or slow down a video on Kapwing's video speed changer.